All these things are, are component parts of an optimized life. And if you uh, shortchange yourself in any one of those, those areas, you don't maximize your opportunity for robust health and longevity and, and extracting the greatest amount of enjoyment out of life. My main message is I wanted to give uh, a visual picture to the audience of what metabolic flexibility looks like. We talk about it, uh, you know, we sort of look at the science, we, we, we look at uh, what you need to do to achieve metabolic flexibility, but what I wanted to do is kind of an entirely new perspective here and have the, the person understand or get a visual of what's going on, the, the compartmentalization of different fuel sources in the body. The idea is to have people get an intuitive sense of how uh, they can derive energy from different substrates in the body without having to think about my macros or think about my meal timing or think about the spacing of uh, uh, you know, protein intake, things like that. It's really just about um, getting that intuitive sense of being able to generate energy from fat on your plate, fat on your body, carbohydrates on your plate, glucose in your bloodstream, glycogen in your, in your muscles, uh, uh, you know, and, and understand that all of these are legitimate energy sources at any point in time. You don't have to be all keto and then not be able to do any glycolytic work or vice versa. The idea behind metabolic flexibility is, is as old as humanity. I mean, we, we had metabolic flexibility millions of years ago, which allowed us to go long periods of time without eating. So in, when, there, when food was not present, we could pull on our stored body fat uh, to combust that in the muscles. We could send some of that fat to the liver to be made into ketones to fuel the brain, offsetting the need to take in any carbohydrate. So we could literally go days at a time without eating and not get hangry and not get you know, overwhelmed with uh, thoughts about uh, depression and I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna die if I don't eat soon. It was just uh, business as usual for, for our ancient ancestors.